You should have warned me that Susie, when you have a baby, you just don't say you want to do something. The correct way is if the baby allows, I will do A, B, C. Because the baby will not sleep. The baby will sleep at 4 a.m. So I had amnesia. These little things, they will enslave you. Let's talk about the color. The color. Also, I put baby girl on my back because it's just easier to do things with her on, on my back. You are very Hey guys, so I just finished doing my hair. This took me two days. So I started on, what's today? Today is Saturday. I started on Thursday. Yeah, I started on Thursday morning and I didn't finish because I also ran out of the braid. And uh, yesterday I had some errands. I went around looking for the braid. No, I didn't go around looking for the braid. I had other things that I wanted to do. So I went to the post office, did some shopping. Um, yeah, I went to the camera house because I wanted to have a look at their microphones and stuff. So I, yeah, so then uh, by the time I got back, I had a headache and I was so tired. So I didn't get to, to do my hair. So now I just woke up in the morning. I think I said it around seven and I am done. What time is it? Yeah, it's literally 11 o'clock. It is 10.56 and I am done with my hair, guys. I think I did a pretty good job. I think I did a pretty good job. I don't know if you guys can see. Uh, my hair is still quite short. That's why I went with this. I initially wanted to do not less braids, but yeah, I ended up going with these ones. I hope they're in focus. Let's change. Okay. 
So these are the twists that I did. I think they look pretty good. And my parting is probably not the best, but I think I did a pretty good job. Um, yeah. And this is the back. Am I in my head? So this is the back. The only problem that I have is my hairline. Guys, I've done a pretty good job with my hairline. Only for past pattern to come and take away everything. <laughs> Look at my hairline. It wasn't grown grown, but it was giving growing. Like it was giving baby hair. But now it's giving bowed, yes, Anna. It is giving bowed. This side is worse, this side. So I'm still going to um, continue taking, I'm still going to continue taking care of my hairline. I've just been using the Love Kinks hairline serum, which has been working really good for me. So I'm going to continue using it. So yeah, other than that, I love my braids. Do I need to sit? Let me sit. Okay, that's better. So, now we need to figure out how to... I have a pattern somewhere here that I did, but I realized it's not in this... It's not like centered. It's not really, really centered. Um, so yeah, it's not really centered and, it, and I think it's not straight, but, um, doesn't matter. I just put it just in case I need to put a parting when wearing my hair. Most of the times I like to wear my hair, um, up. Guys, I'm loving these braids. But the other thing, I also don't know whether to curl the ends, you know, like curl the ends. Uh, put them in hot water and you've got like these little curls. I'm kind of liking them like this and I think I'm gonna leave them like this I don't know. We'll see but I think I'm gonna leave them like this now I'm just gonna try and put uh, my hair up and I am going to show you the braid that I used So this is the fiber that I used. It is called the afro twist braid if it's showing it's called the afro twist braid and this is what the packaging looks like it's got this box um can you see this is what it looks like it's called the afro twist braid okay so now let's put this here up it's a saturday on saturdays i usually have my self-care in the morning which i clearly did not have because it is now 11 o'clock and i didn't do my power pump i just did like a 30 minute pump and as you can see i'm already leaking i've put a face wash but i'm already leaking um i tried to feed baby on this side as well a lot is going on <laughs> so yeah i need to quickly just change this and i'm gonna make um something to eat uh, but i'll shower after because i'm super hungry I'm super hungry, but I don't know how to act because my hair, my hair, my hair is giving. My hair, my hair is giving. Uh, okay. I'm just going to do a loose bun, like so, because I don't want to strain my hairline as well. I think this will do, because I just want the hair to be away from my face and away from baby. If that makes sense so yeah I am just going to quickly make some brekkie I don't know what we we're gonna make waffles we were yeah but there is no fruit that doesn't matter we have grapes <laughs> so we're gonna have waffles and grapes that doesn't sound good but yeah we've got lots of grapes but we don't have like strawberries we've got a little bit of blueberries yeah, that's fine. But I don't know if the strawberries are still okay. So, 
Yeah, we are going to make that. Are we? Yes, we are. Yeah. And I guess this vlog, it's just going to be chaotic because it's the weekend. Okay, so there's been change of plans instead of waffles. It's pretty much the same butter, except that this one is thicker. We are going to make what we call fat cooks. And now, this is a Zimbabwean term. It doesn't look like amakwinya. It is called fat cook. <laughs> I don't know what you call it, but it actually uses self-raising flour instead of yeast and all that stuff so that's what i'm going to make and this recipe guys i honestly just eyeball everything i honestly just eyeball everything because i don't have the measurements to it uh, but yeah so let's just quickly make that i'm so hungry let's just quickly make that and we are literally just going to eat this with tea let me add a little bit more flour Also going to grab some milk from the fridge and some eggs. I'm going to put two eggs. So let me add the dry ingredients first. So I've got my self-raising flour. I'm gonna add some sugar. I'm just using white sugar. I'm gonna put some salt as well. Let's add some salt to taste. So flour, sugar, salt. That's it. I'm just going to mix everything up before I add in my eggs and my milk. Actually, this recipe, we usually just used to put water. We never used to put eggs and um, milk. But because now, I'm just trying to be fancy. <laughs> okay, so let's put the eggs. some milk like i said i'm just eyeballing everything i'm not even sure it's just the consistency that you have to you just have to get the consistency right it, it doesn't have to be too runny not too thick Already I can tell that I need more milk before it comes together because it's actually harder to add milk once you've mixed it till the end so I'm guessing that will be fine if it's too runny you can always add more flour 
Yeah, this is the consistency that you want. I'll bring you closer in a minute. the consistency that we want because we want it to cook through if it's too thick it will just burn before it cooks because we are not deep frying these so now let's head over to the stove so because i made this the other day i already have a pan i made them yesterday i think i already have a pan with a little bit of oil so we are just going to use the same pan and I'm going to heat it up and add some oil. You have to be careful because if the oil is too hot, you will just end up with burnt fat cooks and not cooked through. Add a little bit more oil. You know what, with this recipe guys, I'm literally just doing it the way we used to do it back home. So I just use my hand let me know in the comments if you're familiar with this i just use my hand to kind of feel if the oil is hot or not just make sure not to burn yourself or don't try it at all and my butter is here how cute is this salad bowl guys so this is a salad bowl i don't know if it's wood bamboo whatever it is but i love it it is so good so we're going to use this to put our cooked fat cooks so I am going to grab a paper towel, put it in here, and I will put the ones that are cooked in here. Mm, that's too much oil. Too much oil, too much oil. I actually put way too much oil. But anyways, let's do this. I'm going to start with a small amount just to see if my oil is good. It is pretty good. Broken.
How about you taking water and your nose refilling, right? I haven't took water today. Mm. Mm -hmm. The last I refilled. I I took some yesterday. Hey guys, so jeez man, it is five o'clock. It is four minutes past five. So I slept, I had a shower and I slept. I was just super tired because I woke up quite early today. I usually wake up around eight on Saturdays. But I wake up so early because I just wanted to finish my hair because I wanted to finish my hair before baby started fussing. So now I'm going to make dinner and I feel a bit better. And baby was sleeping as well so she wa she slept first. So she was sleeping in her cot and I was sleeping in the bedroom. She woke up. I fed her and um, her brother brought her to the bedroom so we I just breastfed her and then we both slept and we both just woke up I am feeling a bit better now and a baby is sleeping quite late <laughs> at the moment so that will work well because I'm also feeling a bit better I'm not too tired so now I am going to grab some chicken oh. So I did, oh, I wanted to show you guys, I did my edges. Okay, I hope you can see. So I just did um, my edges somewhere there. So I, I hope it's my, my hairstyle is looking a bit put together. Otherwise, I am loving this hairstyle. I haven't put it in hot water still. I will try and do that tonight because tomorrow we are going to church. So thirsty. All right, so let me grab some chicken. In cook makaya. This is the roast runner. I'm going to make this with rice and peanut butter. So yeah, let's do this. I don't think we got enough time to sort out all the fights. Yeah. Sort out of the lies, oh baby, yeah There was a part of me that knew that And still I'm caught by surprise I thought you'd always be mine I guess our dreams fell asleep There's no passion in the comatose Baby going down, 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 down Baby going down, 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 down Tried so hard to stay afloat Yeah, we keep moving like the river goes Baby going down, 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 down it's time I'm letting you go This time I know it for sure I just thought I should let you know Get yeah, now, no worries no more, no I got so So this is how I like to cook my hard body chicken. I boil it with a little bit of water and then I fry it, boil, fry, up until it's golden brown. Then I just, I don't like too much spices in it, so I just put a little bit of curry powder and I'm not putting anything, I just put the spring onion and I'm going to add a little bit of water because this is actually done. It is now cooked through. So now I'm just going to add um, a little bit of water just to get a little bit of gravy, not too much. And I also like to pour my water on the side, not on top of the chicken because um, it washes out the meat. That's, I don't know, but I just like to do it that way. So now, on a very low heat, I'm going to let it simmer till I get um, some water of the thick gravy not too much just a little also i put baby girl on my back because it's just easier to do things 
with hair on on my back her head control is now better um it's it, uh, it's now good so that's why i have now been putting hair on my back but i'm still using these swaddle clothes so i've got two i've got this one underneath and i've got the other one that i put on top looking at the lights <laughs> i just want to grab my rice Good morning guys so today is sunday and we are going to church i am just going to quickly vacuum <laughs> i don't know if i can vacuum but i want to curl my hair i think i've decided on curling it i want to curl my hair make some porridge and pick up baby's clothes and if i can get time to vacuum where i was doing my hair let me show you so uh, this is where i was sitting when i was doing my hair and there's two hair everywhere here and that's the mirror i was sitting here and that chair i put the mirror so i can be able to see myself so it's still messy if i can get a chance to clear this up up before church that would be great that would be great it's a mess guys but I'm not bothered at all. Guys, I am literally whispering. This is the reason why I haven't gone to church. Um, you know, like I started, I haven't been to church in a while, but this year I started it off on the right foot and I said I want to go to church every Sunday. And I only went like two Sundays and that was it. Because guys, why didn't you remind me that when you have a baby, you just don't plan things. You just don't plan that I'll go to church. Because the baby will not sleep. The baby will sleep at 4 a.m. And in the morning, you'll be too tired. You'll be sleepy. The baby will get sick. Like last week, she had the flu we couldn't go to church like literally she was the other week she had her eczema just flared up like it was so painful to just look at her because the eczema was just really bad so why didn't no one because i think i forgot i had amnesia <laughs> is that what it's called i have dementia i had i, I don't know guys you should have warned me that Susie when you have a baby you just don't say you want to do something the correct way is if the baby allows I will do A, B, C right now I don't know if you can hear her her flu isn't over yet she's still got boogers in her nose like stuff in her nose It's 8 o'clock. Church starts at 10. I need to curl my hair. I don't think I'm going to do it because I wanted to curl the ends. I don't think I'm going to do it. Now I need to pick clothes for her. I don't know what. This looks 
I want her to wear this tutu dress. This is such a beautiful dress that my friend bought her. But I think it's gonna be small soon. And look, it's got long sleeves. Long sleeves. And it's quite warm. Today it's gonna be hot. So I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Hey guys, oh, that's been my life. Let's pick clothes for her while, I, while we chat because these little babies they can enslave you. So I'm just picking up her diaper. I'm not going to bath her this morning. Um, just wipe her. These little things they will enslave you. I'm telling you. You will do things according to them. Um, I think we're just gonna find. Can she wear? You know what? I'm just gonna pick up uh, this and uh, this. Yeah, simple. It's too hot. And. I like these little boys. They're so cute. Or maybe let's put these denim shorts and this little vest. Don't know if you guys can see. Because I like these boys. She hasn't. Uh, so I'm just going to put this little vest and these um, denim undies, whatever they call denim shorts. Pants. Yeah, let's put that there. So since I'm not curling my hair, I think I might try to just quickly vacuum. Because it's dirty. I'll just try to quickly vacuum and make some oats. The kitchen's a mess too because I didn't get a chance to clean it. So, yeah, let's go there, let's go there. Because I wanted to sleep. It's 8 o'clock, guys. So I want to, by 9 o'clock, Nah, let me not vacuum. Because like I said, you know she woke up and whatever. Let me just get ready for church. Hey guys, so today is a Monday and I am so excited. Super, super excited. I've been waiting for this. For this, my baby. I've been waiting for this. If you follow me on Instagram, you know that I recently lost a lot of footage. So I had been uh, filming like for days, <laughs> for months actually. I lost a whole lot of footage because I had filmed so many videos um, postpartum. As soon as I felt like I can do this, I had compiled a lot of footage and I lost it. I lost it in edit and I nearly cried. And I went for a week without recording anything, without editing anything. And I had told myself that I would put up three videos a week, but that hasn't been possible because my computer, after it deleted my footage, it became really slow and it was lagging, it was taking forever. So I ordered uh, this baby here, which just arrived and I'm super excited to unbox it with you on camera. And if you are anything like me, you know that I hate a rambling if someone says they if someone says they are unboxing something i just want them to unbox it so without wasting much of your time let's get into it i'm super excited for this guys oh this is beautiful
already loving the blue. It's looking beautiful, beautiful. This is the keyboard. So I am back. I'm back guys. I took a break because I had to breastfeed mom Judy's. So with this iMac, uh, we upgraded quite a few things, which is what I want to talk about. If you are interested in knowing exactly the specifics of what we got, just a disclaimer before I start talking, because I don't know these technological what what don't don't terms i am just going to tell you what i got and i'm not going to go into detail because i don't know much about anything but i know about the little upgrades that i added because i wanted this machine to be really good and the other thing is uh the imac that i was using i got it off a facebook markets in 2019 it was a 2014, uh, it was a 2014 iMac. Yeah, it was a 2014. So the person that sold it to me got it in 2014, but it was pretty good. But now it just, yeah, it's been really slow. It's been lagging. And what pushed me to getting this one was because it deleted all my footage. So yeah. Anyways, just to make this straight to the point, I am going to start by talking about the screen. So uh, this is a 24 inch a screen, which is an upgrade from what I have been using. I believe the one that I've been using is a 21 inch. And uh, guys, let's talk about the color, uh, the color oh is this yeah the color so this is a blue this is the blue iMac it is a dark blue at the back oh, it is stunning I love this color and in the front it's got like a lighter shade of blue which is just at the bottom at the bottom here 
oh it is a stunning it is stunning guys i wish you could see it in person i'm just looking down on my phone because that's where i am looking i am getting all this information uh also got uh, um also upgraded the memory i upgraded it to 16 gig 16 gig unified memory don't know what that means but <laughs> 16 gig memory and one terabyte SSD storage so when I did my research I realized when you are into video into video editing and photography you need a, a bigger memory is it a bigger memory and uh, more storage so that was the other upgrade that I did and okay so the other upgrade was on the magic keyboard so every ima comes with a magic keyboard but the upgrade that i did here was having a touch id which is the little button here and that means if you have more than one person using the computer they can have their own profile and their information which no one can access if that makes sense <laughs> anyways yeah i just um wanted to have that feature also got bought the magic mouse and um the touchpad what is it called magic mouse and magic trackpad okay so i also got bought the magic mouse and the magic trackpad so i love this for editing guys because i went to the apple store and i actually spent some time on the com on the imac and i used it with both of these and it is amazing if you are someone who edits on your imac and you know you can get to i don't know if you are an editor like if you edit videos you know how you use both hands and i found it really 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 efficient to have your other hand on the trackpad while you're using the mouse so uh, that's why got both and what else i think uh, those are the main things that i wanted to let you know about i am so happy i'm so excited and like i say 2024 especially uh, these six months that i am on a leave i have dedicated them to making my best producing my best doing everything that i um you know everything that i want to do in terms of my content creation journey i am going to give it my all in these six months and i am also doing a few exciting things off camera which are not like youtube videos and stuff so i've been really busy and i feel like um this is just gonna take my whole whole passion to the next level i also want to revive my blog and my website because i would like to also share like my recipes and a whole lot of you know all things suzy q wise things i would like to share them there on my blog where i just share my favorite things my tips and all that stuff so i am really really excited about this one good morning guys today is sunday I just had a shower and we are not going to church today because I want to fix my son's hair. I'm going to try and attempt doing um, locks. I've never done that before. But nothing my hands can't do if I put my mind to it. So hopefully we can do that. The only thing, because I've never done them before, it might take me time. I've been doing twists. So I'm going to try and do like locks, like because uh, I can't keep up with having to redo his hair every now and then. So at least if we go for locks, we can just lock it. He doesn't want short hair, by the way. So I'm going to close off this vlog today. And I will do a little bit of unboxing. 
I don't know. It's, it's not even much. But I just wanted to show you something before I close off this vlog. I actually have a lot of footage that I was going to put into this vlog. But I don't know. Let me know, guys, how you feel in the comments about longer vlogs. Because I was up to a lot of things during this week. And I felt like if I do like a one hour vlog, people may not be interested. Even though you guys have actually kind of watched the other vlog, which was one hour, 15 minutes. Just let me know in the comments how you feel. If you like the vlogs to be 45 minutes and below or to be one hour and above what you prefer. Because um, it, it's pointless for me to make longer vlogs when no one is going to watch till the end. So, yeah, before we close off this vlog, I'm just going to show you a few things that I got. Why is my camera... I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, I got... I went to Bonds the other day and Target. I didn't get a bag from Target because bags are super expensive. So I got two more bras. I'm actually wearing the other one. I got two more nursing bras because, yeah, so I got the black one and this color. I don't know what you call this color. I got two more bras. So now I think I have six nursing bras, which is, I don't know. Initially, I felt like, oh. You know, like nursing bras, what's the point when I'm going to start wearing my normal bras again? But I just realized because I plan on breastfeeding for about a year. So that means I'll need to be in nursing bras because they're just easy when you're feeding baby. And also, I've just realized that I have to wash my bras every day because I only have like the other two from mom cozy. I'm not wearing them as often. But guys, you're always, sometimes you, you leak and everything. So I just realized that I need more bras. So I went ahead and got two more bras. And I passed by Target. And I got my baby. These little things. I don't know what they're called. They're panties. No. Oh, he's crying. She, she's crying. But it's okay. <laughs> they can handle her. <laughs> So I got these two, got these two shorts. I love them because it's really hot, guys. I just pop this. It's super hot. I just put on uh, this and a singlet, and she will be fine. So that's what I got from Bonds and Target. And I also got myself this from Priceline. I got myself. my gel polish kit so this comes with a light and it comes with a few more it comes with a light and a number of gel polishes guys i also i already have a led uv light led light whatever it's called i already had a led light but i've had that one for nine years and now it is broken kind of the what do you call it the little button on top is now broken so i just decided to get this one and also that one was a bit small for doing my toes so guys doing nails has become super expensive super super expensive and i am all for cutting costs because doing my fingernails can cost easily cost me eighty dollars that's a lot of money so i like i got this wow it's a kit it's a kit it's a kit not yet give me 10 minutes please oh can you please bring my phone can you bring my phone and you know that light that I use for my nails? Hmm? Can you please bring my phone? Yes. Do you know that light that I use for my for my f nails? What, what light? Yeah. That thing that I put my nails in, that is a light. 
of to, that. Yeah, what color is it? Really? Orange. Stop guessing. You know where my nail stuff is in the laundry? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. You see it. You know it, right? Um, yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. can you bring it, please? Close the door. Where's your phone? It's somewhere on the table. Okay, so he's gonna bring that and I'll show you guys. This is a really good kit. Look at this. So this is the lights. This one is quite big than what I have. So I've also I've also ordered an e-file on Shein, like the electronic file, because filing with your hands can take you forever. It comes with five of these. These ones cost 20 bucks each. This is a base coat and this is a top coat. And these are the three different colors. And this is the actual light. It also comes with a nail file and um, the buffer. It also comes with this one, which is a shining sock. And you can also use it to remove the polish. And these are the sock thing, the foil. I guess you can purchase more of these. So I got this for 100 bucks. I went to get these and this is $20 each. So I just figured, you know, it's coming with five of these. So already 20 and these are the full sizes, by the way. So already $20 by five of these is 100 bucks. So I just figured, you know. Uh, it's a good buy. Oh my god, I think I have to put she's crying. So this is the light that I've had for nine years. I got this. Is it nine years? Yeah, I got this in 2014. 2014. And the little button here that you press for it to light, it's off. It's somewhere in the laundry. So I have to put it on top. So it's just become... It still works, by the way. Uh, but it has just uh, become... To be honest, I just wanted to get a new one. <laughs> Anyways, guys, let me end this vlog here. I hope you really enjoyed this one. And I will see you in my next one, which I am already editing. The sun is coming and going. That's one thing that I hate about this natural light. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for the numbers. Thank you for the subscriptions. Please do not forget to subscribe, to share the video to like to comment it just helps for the video to reach new people and to reach a wider audience so that we can keep growing and please 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 most importantly do not skip the ads and i will see you in my next one i thank you oh my goodness